Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a car logo flip. Duplicate the video twice. Rename Frisk 2 videos, first going to be flip layer and second, clean one. Toggle off first and the last layers. Cut the clean layer at the time from where you want that effect to start, also cut the ending. We need to mask the car logo, grab the pen tool and make a nice selection. Don't worry if the selection is not perfect, we need to remove the logo first. Press M button, right click on the mask and select track mask. I suggest to track the mask manually. Correct the points of the mask. That's why you have to mask it manually, auto masking sometimes not working well. Change masking mode to subtract. Add a feather a bit and expansion. Then go to Content Aware Fill, copy my settings and press Generate Fill Layer. This will remove the car logo. Move down the fill layer under the flip layer, cut the fill layer as well. Toggle on the flip layer and cut it too. We can start animating the logo. Create a perfect mask of the logo. I will use Mocha AE for the best results. Grab the elliptical tool and make a perfect selection of the logo. You can use a pen tool or Roto Burst tool for selection, it's up to you. But if you have Mocha AE, use Mocha, it's the best way to track anything. Once it finished the tracking, click the Save button and close Mocha AE. Under the Mocha, expand Matte and click on Create AE Masks. Just look what a smooth selection we have. Press on Anchor Point tool and move the anchor point to the center of the logo. Go to very end of the flip layer, press on P and set a keyframe, press S and create a keyframe, enable 3D for flip layer and create Y rotation keyframe as well. Now go to very beginning of the flip layer and set the same keyframes. Enable the last layer. Go to the middle of the video and press U on your keyboard to see all keyframes. Change position, set Y rotation to 1 and add scale a bit. Enable motion blur on a timeline. Select all the keyframes we have made and press F9 on your keyboard. Go to graph editor and make a curve like this. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.